The President, le Président, Mesdames et Messieurs, veuillez vous asseoir. Is now in session. Nous reprenons l'audience. We continue hearing the testimony of Sheikh Don, and it is now time for the civil party lawyers to put questions to the witness. The chamber would like to know also how time is allocated among the civil party lawyer groups. Et nous voudrions savoir de quelle manière le temps imparti au cours de la partie civile est organisé. Your Honours. We have already discussed and reached an agreement. Nous avons déjà débattu de ce point parmi nous, et nous sommes arrivés à un accord. Et donc, mon groupe, groupe numéro trois, va utiliser l'intégralité du temps de parole. First, I would like to put questions. And uh, my colleague would uh, follow with some remaining questions. Par la suite ma, Good la morning, Mr. Witness. I am much Vannery. I am here Maitre representing Sbanneri Civil Party Group Bonjour, 3. Témoin, I have a couple of questions to be put to you. And if you feel you are not certain whether you understand si my questions, please ask me to repeat them. Questions. And I would like to Pas thank you in advance for de répéter, responding to my questions. My question is, at one questions. point in time, you were taken from your hometown to work. And You stated uh, in response to Judge Lavenge that you were taken by the militia and that you were assigned to pass the path after the militia was assigned to pass the path. Can you please tell the court how you were taken from the hometown and were you given a moment to say farewell to your family? Do you understand my question? Adieu à votre famille. Est-ce que vous comprenez ma question? Response. I would like you to clarify it a little bit further. Est-ce que vous pouvez m'expliquer un petit peu? Uh, so I would dire. like Maître you Savannery. to just tell the court how you were taken from your hometown and at in which location were you de votre at uh, when you were being taken from and were you given an opportunity to say goodbye to vous a donné your de dire au revoir à vos parents? Response. Réponse. I did not have any opportunity to say goodbye. I was just taken away immediately. Response. Thank you for your information. Next. I would like to proceed with the next question in relation to the arrest of your chief of the group named Pao. Du chef de votre groupe, dénommé Pao. Can you tell us where were, or where was he detained? Uh, was he detained at Preso or S21, or what happened to him? Où il a été détenu? A -il été détenu après he ça, was ou arrested ou and detained at the Réponse, prison, but I did not see in which Mais room he was detained, because normally people who stayed together when they were arrested, uh, we would not be allowed to see where they would have been detained. Euh, Ensemble, mais nous, thank nous you. Uh, pas la question. De voir thank you. So, how did you know that the person was detained at S21? Comment saviez-vous que cette personne était détenue à S21? It, Réponse. When the person disappeared, and especially uh, those who worked in the compound would have been detained inside the prison, not elsewhere. Euh, eh bien, elle était détenue à l'intérieur de la prison Next. et pas autre part. You said you Question, vous avez dit que vous avez pu constater les some lésions, les blessures and that, sur le corps uh, in des détenus. Et lors de votre déposition that, uh, auprès des co-juges d'instruction, vous avez indiqué que vous avez vu the injuries, 
when the nails missing les blessures, and others. In the record of the interview, you also stated that uh, some detainees uh, got their head uh, qui, uh, split open or the, the wounds in the head. Uh, so can you tell the court uh, how severe were the wounds uh, sustained on the heads of some detainees and how could detainees de got, uh, get uh, such wounds? présenter et suite à quoi les détenus auraient pu présenter de telles blessures au niveau de la tête. Réponse. Pouvez-vous préciser votre question Question. Devant les coups d'instruction, vous avez dit que vous avez vu que certains des prisonniers présentaient des blessures au niveau du crâne, que les personnes avaient des lésions à ce niveau-là. Est-ce que vous pouvez expliquer à la Chambre de quelle manière, qu'est-ce qui aurait pu occasionner de telles blessures Est-ce que vous comprenez l'objet de ma question Réponse. Malheureusement, je ne peux pas répondre à cette question. Je ne répondrai pas à cette question. I would like to proceed with the last question before I question. will je give the floor to my colleague to proceed with further questions. In document D28-19, on page with ERN 0016-3851, you said you saw the accused inside the political school. You saw him twice. Do you remember having said that? If so, do say so in the court. If not, do also say you did not remember. You don't remember. You can confirm your declaration, President. Response: I saw him twice. Je l'ai vu à deux reprises. But I don't really remember. Mais je ne me rappelle pas. Exactement quelles étaient Question. les so circonstances. Said, uh, Question. Vous avez dit que vous l'avez vu deux fois, mais vous n'êtes pas sûr où vous l'avez vu. Mais vous n'êtes pas correct? sûr de l'endroit où vous l'avez vu. Est-ce exact Réponse. Réponse. C'est exact. I have no further questions. Question, je n'ai pas d'autres questions à vous poser. I would like uh, my colleague uh, to je proceed with the rest of the questions. Je souhaiterais la parole à ma confrère pour lui permettre de poursuivre. Oui, bonjour, Monsieur Sagdan. Je m'appelle Fatima Trus, donc je suis uh, co-avocat dans le Ms. groupe Fabrice 3, et je vous remercie de votre présence ici. Vous avez maintenant 48 ans. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Pouvez-vous me dire ce que vous ressentez maintenant sur cette période que vous avez vécue entre 1975 et 1979 Quel est votre sentiment sur cette période Comment vous le voyez à l'heure actuelle Comment vous le voyez Response. Réponse. I thought back then that everyone would have been killed except uh, those people who worked uh, at the, my location. Être tué, sauf les personnes qui travaillaient là où j'étais. Je comprends bien ce que vous dites, question. mais I understand ma question what était le fait de savoir But my comment vous voyez les choses aujourd'hui avec see votre regard today. dans le mur. Qu'est-ce que vous ressentez aujourd'hui Comment vous voyez cette période Response. I don't think I understand the question very well. Je ne pense pas véritablement comprendre la question. Est-ce que vous ressentez aujourd'hui une souffrance sur ce que vous avez vu pendant cette période? Est-ce que vous avez vu 
provoque aujourd'hui chez vous euh, des problèmes éventuellement de sommeil, de santé Est-ce que vous pensez souvent à cette période Est-ce que you cela vous gêne Do you have anxiety Do you have sleep loss Does it worry you Response. Well, back then, I was so worried that uh, one day I too would uh, be uh, taken away to be killed because I would uh, make any mistakes. For Moi example. aussi, pour être éliminé. Donc, j'étais euh, très inquiet. J'avais très peur de faire des erreurs. Je voudrais vous juste question. revenir sur une question que vous I'd a posée, like Maître Sauvagnerie Mock. Elle vous a euh, donc indiqué que vous aviez rencontré une à, deux personnes, à deux périodes. Est-ce que vous vous rappelez ce qu'il a dit pendant ces rencontres Do you remember what he said when you met him on those two occasions Response. Réponse. He, yeah, uh, he lectured in the Il political sessions animé and um, I don't know much of uh, the lectures he, je ne me he was pas giving at that quelle time. Était la teneur de ses propos lors de ces séances à l'époque. Oh. Je n'ai plus de questions. I have no further questions, says Ms. Fabienne trus -Napose. The president, uh, the civil party lawyers, you still have 10 more minutes. We don't know whether you would like to proceed uh, with other questions. I don't know whether other lawyers of the groups uh, would like to put some questions to the witness. Otherwise, uh, the chamber would like to now give the floor to the defense counsel to put questions to the witness. So my question Thank you, Mr. President, Your Honours, and the Chamber. Mr. Don, you said that you were the child medic at S21. You saw the ambulance with uh, the hospital sign before uh, the S21 compound. Do you remember what color was the car? Response. It was a white uh, car with a hospital blanche. symbol. Avec le symbole de l'hôpital. Question. À poser sur ce véhicule. Question. Did you know that the car belonged to S21? Ce véhicule appartenait à S21. Or was it? Uh, did it belong to other units instead? Appartenait à d'autres unités plutôt. I would like, I would not uh, like to respond to this question. Je ne pas répondre à cette question. Question two. Question. You said the medic house stored uh, Prahok underneath the house. Eh bien, un lieu uh, was, où were you suspicious why the Prahok uh, was stored uh, under the medic house, not at the kitchen. Response. I was 
suspicious why these uh, kind of fermented fish or perhaps stored uh, at their medic house other than uh, the kitchen. Question. Thank Question. you. Actually, was Merci. the fermented uh, fish just brought in recently? Le poisson fermenté. Response. Um, it was only brought in recently. Récemment, le poisson, est-ce que c'était quelque chose qui se, se passait comme ça? Thank Réponse. you. When you distributed oui, medicines to the detainees, Question. did Merci. you ever see Lorsque vous dispensiez des médicaments aux détenus, uh, use any tortures against any detainees? Vu donc... Um, Infliger des euh, tortures Response. aux I détenus. Never saw Réponse, him directly, je ne l'ai jamais vu directement but, uh, he ordered, uh, faire cela, such tortures mais il because, a donné l'ordre à ce que vous avez ordré Ping et d'autres personnes pour utiliser des tortures. Vous par exemple donner l'ordre à Ping ou à d'autres personnes d'utiliser des méthodes de torture. Donc vous n'avez pas vu directement des méthodes de torture que vous avez utilisées par d'autres personnes. Est-ce que c'est correct? Uh, response. I would um, not que d'autres personnes want to disaient cela. Réponse. Je ne souhaite pas répondre à cette question. 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 You said that the chief of the medics, the adult chief of medics, uh, were arrested, medical, and that only Deutsch who made uh, such order Arrêté. of the arrest. Donc, what kind of evidence euh, could you obtain telle, to prove that uh, -ce que vous you knew that Deutsch ordered such arrests? Que Response. Que a donné It is obvious that he was the chief of that location. Réponse. C'était évident que c'était Deutsch parce qu'il était so, le responsable. Uh, having le, le the, earning the title de as the chairperson, then you can presume that he could have ordered such arrest. Is that correct? Directeur, qui avait donné de telle uh, that's that's Réponse. what I concluded because he was the chief, so no one else could uh, uh, carry out uh, any order. Question. So were you suspicious that other people on top of him would uh, have ordered donné. such arrest? Response. I have no idea because I only learned that it Et was Deutsch who made uh, such uh, orders. De quel, uh, Thank you, Mr. President. I would like to share the floor with my uh, um, co-colleagues. Um, the President, Mr. Je vous remercie. Je n'ai plus deux questions à poser. Le Président, Monsieur Fran Maître Roux, je vous en prie. Merci, Monsieur le Président. Thank you, Mr. President. Merci, Monsieur le témoin. Thank you, Je voudrais witness. vous poser quelques questions like pour que vous nous aidiez à éclaircir un certain so nombre de points. Can help us shed light on a of Dans votre déclaration In devant les enquêteurs du juge d'instruction, il est indiqué que vous êtes né en 1961 dans le visa village de Trapin Krabao. Est-ce que c'est bien exact It's correct that I was born in Trapeang Krabao, the Kampong Chnang. Trapeang Krabao, in the province of Kampong Chnang. And you were born in 1961. Is that correct? 
Response, it's correct. Réponse, oui, c'est exact. Alors, M. Segdan, si Mr. vous êtes Sekdan, né en 1961, en 1975, vous n'aviez pas 11 ans, comme vous l'avez déclaré à la Chambre, mais vous aviez 14 ans. Est-ce que c'est bien exact Response. I'm not good at calculating it, so I may not respond. Je vais choisir de ne pas répondre. Dans mon langage, on dit les chiffres parlent d'eux-mêmes. Donc, si vous nous confirmez que vous êtes né en 1961, vous aviez donc 14 ans. En 1975. Est-ce que vous avez dit que vous étiez d'abord euh, en 1975, vous avez d'abord été désigné pour venir à Phnom Penh et que vous étiez venu à l'école militaire vous avez dit que vous aviez passé trois mois à l'école militaire, c'est bien exact Et ensuite, vous avez dit aux enquêteurs des co-juges d'instruction que vous êtes allé cultiver le riz et construire la digue comme les autres habitants. Est-ce que vous vous souvenez combien de temps vous êtes allé cultiver le riz et construire la digue après ces trois mois Combien de temps After the three months you mentioned. Response. I don't remember how many months, although I worked uh, at the rice fields uh, at different places. Euh, à la rizière pendant cette période. Alors, est-ce qu'on peut essayer Question. de... Est-ce qu'on peut essayer avec, euh, avec des étapes Est-ce que vous avez Can passé à la rizière une année de culture de riz one year, say, Une période entière de culture de riz farm. Plus d'une période ou moins d'une période entire season at the rice farm or did you spend less than one season there? Response. Réponse. I worked uh, there for one season after another. Une saison après une autre. Donc, on peut dire Question. que vous avez travaillé so, pendant deux saisons, c'est ça It can be said that you worked there for two seasons. Would that be correct Response. I don't um, respond to this question. Je ne souhaite pas répondre à cette question. Euh, 
Monsieur le témoin, je rappelle Mr. que vous pouvez refuser de répondre à des questions qui vous incriminent, mais pas à d'autres questions. Alors, je vais essayer de vous aider. Si euh, vous êtes resté à la rizière deux saisons de riz, est-ce que vous êtes d'accord avec moi pour dire que c'est vous êtes resté à la rizière environ une année Est-ce que vous êtes d'accord avec moi pour considérer que vous êtes resté à la rizière environ une année Réponse, I don't understand réponse, your question. Je ne comprends pas votre question. Mais le président, uh, the counsel for the witness, you can take the floor. But before giving the floor to the counsel, I would like uh, to, uh, we would like to inform the witness that uh, you can decline to respond to any questions that you believe. Qui could uh, sell incriminate you, for example, like, uh, have you ever killed anyone? And this kind of response, if you say yes, then uh, would implicate uh, or would uh, incriminate uh, you. But here, you are obliged to tell the truth, nothing but the truth, something you witnessed, you still remember vu, and uh, you vous vous have rappelez, to tell the court uh, that you don't remember or you remember si or not and oui you cannot non, just uh, not to respond to the questions that are not self-incriminating you. Do you understand this? The witness, uh, um, pas I don't uh, quite understand uh, that much. The counsel for the witness, could you please Please explain to le the witness in relation to his testimony. The counsel, thank you, Mr. President. Uh, I will need uh, some time to talk with the witness. I would like to make a small remark in relation to the memory of the witness. The witness has poor memory, so may I suggest that uh, people who put questions uh, shorten their questions so that uh, the questions are brief, precise, and uh, that uh, the witness find it easy to respond. Otherwise, he will not respond to such questions. So when he does not respond to questions, it appears that he doesn't understand the question instead uh, rather than uh, he did not want to respond. The president uh, allowed the counsel to consult the witness. President, j'autorise le conseil du témoin à euh, parler à son client.
Jane, may we President, the defense counsel, Mr. Ru, you can continue your questioning to the witness. Oui, merci, Mr. Monsieur Roux, le Président. Thank you, Mr. President. Donc, Monsieur le Témoin, so, j'essaye juste avec Dan, votre aide uh, d'essayer de, de comprendre les dates uh, que vous avez données dans votre déclaration. Est-ce que vous vous souvenez de la déclaration que vous avez faite aux enquêteurs des, to, to des juges d'instruction, vous vous souvenez de cette déclaration Monsieur Sekdan Response, I don't really recall it well. Non, je ne m'en souviens pas vraiment très bien. Bon, parce que dans cette déclaration, okay, vous avez donné des dates assez précises. Alors, je veux juste vérifier so avec vous aujourd'hui si on a raison de considérer ces dates ou si, au contraire, right vous nous dites uh, que les dates que vous avez données ne, ne sont pas vraiment la réalité. Really C'est ça que je veux vérifier avec vous. Je reprends. Well, let me start again. Vous avez donc indiqué que said après that after le 17 avril 1975, vous êtes venu à Phnom Penh that you said that you came to Phnom Penh et que vous avez passé trois mois à l'école militaire. Months, uh, vous avez ensuite and indiqué que vous êtes allé cultiver le riz pendant deux saisons. Est-ce que c'est bien cela Indeed, what you said? Response. That was that is correct. That was oui, my statement. Exact, si si Mr. on essaye and if we try de retrouver to find la chronologie des événements, to to, ça voudrait events, dire this would que vous êtes arrivé Avril 1975, trois mois à l'école militaire, mai, juin, juillet, mai, juin, juillet 1975. So? Deux so, saisons, that, ça then, fait à peu près un peu plus d'une année. Ça voudrait year. dire so this would mean que vous êtes après arrivé à S21 au milieu de 1976, d'après ces calculs. Est-ce que ça vous paraît possible, dans votre souvenir d'être arrivé à S21 au milieu de 1976. Response. It was 1978. Non, c'était en 78. It was in early 1978. Voilà, c'est effectivement, c'est ce que vous avez dit aux enquêteurs des juges d'instruction, vous êtes arrivé en 78. Mais alors là, M. Sekdan, si vous êtes arrivé en 78 à S21, vous n'aviez pas 11 ans, vous aviez 17 ans. Bon, c'était juste euh, une affirmation de ma part. Vous n'êtes pas obligé de répondre là. Mais je, le calcul est simple. Est, si vous êtes né en 61 et si vous arrivez à S21 en 78, vous n'avez pas 11 ans. Est-ce que vous savez en quelle année... Euh, Paor. Paor a été tué. Was killed. Do you know in which year Paor vous avez dit que l'unité était dirigée par Paor au début. Est-ce que vous savez en quelle année il a été tué Et vous savez en quelle année il a été tué 
Response. It was in the early of the year that I went to work at S21, but I cannot recall the exact date when he was killed. En tout cas, Mr. selon Moon, votre souvenir, case, as as recall, quand vous arrivez à l'unité médicale, Paor est encore le chef. C'est bien exact and he, he was in charge of the child medics. Alors, vous avez parlé Mr. également so, about, de, um, de Yun, Yun, son ancien adjoint qui a pris la suite. Et vous avez dit que Yun s'est perdu. Qui a pris la suite de Yun Réponse. Là, nous avons pris la fuite. So, at that time, because of the situation, nobody was yet appointed to replace him. Vous voulez Mr. dire Hu, que Yun so s'est pendu juste avant l'arrivée des Vietnamiens, juste avant janvier 1979 Oui, c'est exact. Au-dessus de vos chefs, and above qui était le supérieur your, hiérarchique uh, direct leaders, who was your direct superior above your leaders Response. there was nobody else in my group that is the medical group i was only had, i only had a chief of the group chef de group At my location, there was no platoon or company. The top one was the chief of the group. Probably there would be company or platoons in various other units. Est-ce que si je vous donne le nom de Peng, ça vous dit quelque chose Does that mean anything to you? Does that ring a bell with you? Response. I heard the name Peng, oui, and I used Peng. to see him, but uh, Peng was not in my unit. Parfois, mais il faisait pas partie de mon groupe. Hein. Et qui était-ce Il ne faisait pas partie de votre groupe, d'accord Quelles étaient ses fonctions, okay, Peng, vous savez qui faisait partie d'une autre unité. He was in the guard unit who, whose duty was to guard the prisoners. Response. Très bien. Question, fine. Euh, et avez-vous entendu parler de Hor? Have you ever heard about Hor? Response. I saw Taho. Oui, he had a crooked mouth. Or. Il avait la bouche tordue. D'accord. Mais encore, fine. quel était le rôle de Hor? But then, what was Hor's position? Rôle? 
What was his role? Response. I did not know his position or his role. I only saw him there, but I think he must hit one of the senior roles uh, working together with Duke. Vous vous souvenez que tout à l'heure, quand le juge Tomouni vous a interrogé pour vous demander si vous connaissiez les autres responsables, vous avez dit que non. Donc vous connaissez les autres responsables, monsieur le témoin. Alors, je vais continuer à essayer de vous rafraîchir la mémoire. Si je vous parle de tri, est-ce que ça vous dit quelque chose Response. I used to see three. Oui, je voyais three. I think for one or two months when I arrived. Un ou deux mois au moment où je suis arrivé. He was also in the medical Il unit with Pao. Avec Pao. That's all I know about voilà, tout ce three. Que je sais sur three. And slap a high for any. But I think he is already dead. Il est mort aujourd'hui. Vous l'avez vu pendant seulement so un ou deux mois Au début 1978 Au début 1978, est-ce que c'est ça Je suis très 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 Je vous indique Question. que certains des I témoins like qui ont comparu ici ont précisé que Tri était là jusqu'à la fin et qu'il s'est échappé, il a pris la fuite en même temps que tout le monde. Vous ne l'avez pas vu. At that time, he was arrested, so I presume he was dead. Non, il était arrêté, donc moi j'ai pensé qu'il était mort. Voulez-vous nous dire avec qui vous avez pris la fuite Qui était avec vous quand vous avez pris la fuite En janvier 1979. Response. At that time, all of us fled all together. I fled with those child medics who came from my village. So there were three of us uh, fleeing together. First we fled together, but after we were fired upon, we, uh, we split and there were only three of us together. So I was not with the main group anymore. There were only us, the three of us, and the other two children, they were a bit older and had a bigger build than me. The President, uh, the Defense Council, uh, please be reminded that your time has elapsed. Monsieur le Président, je souhaiterais que l'on tienne compte du temps que l'avocat a passé avec le témoin et qui ne fait pas partie de mon temps d'interrogatoire. So therefore, I would like to be able to finish uh, questioning the witness.
How much time do you think you actually need and the chamber will make a decision accordingly? You are reminded that the chamber has already allocated the time for each party and actually you, the chamber has granted you seven extra minutes on top of the time allocated to you. And then we will still need time for the accused to make his observations to this witness testimony and also a time is allocated for the witness to respond to the observation by the accused if he has any. And this morning actually the accused made a preliminary observation already. I need three minutes, Mr. President. The President, you are granted three additional minutes. Merci, Monsieur le Président. Thank you, Mr. President. Et, Monsieur le témoin, voulez-vous juste nous dire avec quelles autorités vous êtes parti le 7 janvier 1979 Nous sommes partis dans un grand groupe. Quels étaient les responsables qui étaient avec vous Au départ, au moment où vous partez. Response. There were many people, so I did not know whether any leaders were fleeing at the same time with us, and I was scared too at the time. So I did not go and look at the buildings where I used to work. I was just fleeing myself along with a few other people. I was only concentrating on fleeing. That's all. I have no further questions. Thank you. The President. The President. The Chamber would like now to give opportunity to the accused to make his observation regarding this witness testimony. The accused, you are reminded that you can make your observation within the testimony of this witness and you are not allowed to make other observations in relation to testimonies of other witnesses who have already provided their testimonies. The accused. Mr. President, my observation Mr. to President. the chamber at this time is that this witness, Sekdon, is a son of a peasant from a countryside. He has limited memory and education, and take into account all these factors, it is likely that he was sent to S21. However, the testimony provided by him has contradictory timelines. For example, Pao. Pao did not live in 1978. He died before that. And the reason is that uh, Comrade Pao, like, uh, Pao, when Ho had a diarrhea, Pao gave Ho some medication and then Ho got seizure and I reported this incident to Sun Sen because the medicine had arsenic substance in it and then Sun Sen ordered me to arrest Pao and he was arrested and smashed. And I did not want to talk about the other chief before Pao, but Pao died before that time. So 
So the contradiction in his testimony leads me to believe that he doesn't seem to be a staff of S21. So that is my first observation. And for the second observation is that he knew three other people from Kampong Chnang. That is Mon, Tim, Tim, whose names I cannot recall, Ce sont des noms dont je me and he also talked about a comrade Yun who Yun hanged himself to death. Qui, uh, I was the chairman of S21. I S21. never heard of any S21 staff who committed suicide by hanging himself. Serait, uh, and when I was a deputy, yes, one person, uh, one staff oui, vrai, died due to the mort, electrocution. Uh, uh, and I reported that incident through my superior. And regarding the ambulance, Autre point, pour ce qui est de ambulance, which arrived at the entrance of the prison, and I think that street is 113, there would be no vehicle ever there to enter the entrance or at the street attached to the entrance of one. All the vehicles would only stop at point A, which I marked on the sketch, except the vehicle of a Sonsen, which arrived at the entrance where Ho and I waited to greet him. That was the only vehicle authorized to enter it. So all these points, make me believe that he could not grasp the actual situation of S21. So it is my impression that, impression in general, his testimony générale, is based on the situation. And when he talks about the general situation of the prisoners, he talks about the rapid pellet medicines and about the medicines that he, he used to, that he ate. So in general, it seems that his testimony is acceptable. But based on the points that I just raised, it makes me suspicious of his testimony. And that is all. The president. Merci. Judge Lavange, you may proceed. Oui, je souhaiterais juste Judge savoir si l'accusé a des documents like qui permettraient d'établir la date à laquelle euh, Or aurait été victime de cette réaction et à la date à laquelle Nouméaux aurait été exécuté. The accused, Your Honor, Monsieur le Juge, Pao, who was arrested at S21, I could not recall it exactly because I cannot recall his surname. The documents that can be found is only his confession. I think his confession is. Uh, still at S21, and based on that document, then we can know the exact nature of his arrest. John. Mr. Sekdon, Monsieur Sekdon, do you have any reasons to tell the chamber that you are actually a medical child medic working Vous dites que vous étiez enfant at et membre de S21. That you dispense the medicines, Vous that you cleanse the wounds of the prisoners at S21, besides what you have provided in your testimony Alors, to the chamber this morning. This is in response to the observation made by the accused that he, he doubts 
that you were a medical staff at S21. I really worked there and the people who came with me to work there could be the proof. The president, who were they? Le président. Who are they? Qui sont ces personnes? Response. Réponse. Mien learned uh, already that uh, I was the child medic. Uh, the president, what was, uh, what is the uh, that person full name? de l'équipe médicale. Le président, quel était le Response. nom complet de cette I personne? I don't remember his full name, Réponse, but je me rappelle pas de son he worked uh, nom. there. The president, uh, what did uh, Mien do at S21? Please wait until you see the red light. Otherwise, your response cannot be communicated. And please, for the good record, wait until you see the red light. You said uh, you know that Mien, Vous avez dit que Mien could uh, shed some light in relation to your existence at S21. So what did he do at S21? Response, he, he was a guard. He knows me as Don, the child medic. The president, uh, thank you very much, uh, Mr. Sek Don, for your attendance before the ECCC. We note uh, how very difficult this has been for you because you have been questioned uh, from several parties to the proceedings and that the fact at issue was something more than 30 years ago and that at that time you were very young and uh, your educational background uh, was very limited uh, too and this makes your memory is uh, rather poor, and uh, the chamber noted that you have been working your best uh, to fulfill your duty as a witness to shed light in relation to the facts uh, to the chamber. The chamber has no further questions to be put to you, and uh, you are now allowed to go back to your residence and the court official is now instructed to take uh, Mr. Sek Don to meet uh, with the West unit uh, so that the unit can take him back uh, to his residence. The court uh, finds it now convenient to take an adjournment uh, for lunch so we will adjourn and uh, we will resume at 1.30 p.m. By then, we are going to hear another witness, KW21. So please, the parties to the proceedings and the public be informed. The detention facility security personnel are now instructed to take the accused back to the detention facility. Au centre de détention. Sommes-nous en grand chose? Les greffiers, all right. Messieurs, levez-vous.